Good fish. Oh. Yeah. He is a good fish. Yeah. On the way up. Yeah. He's really good. Yeah. Pretty much the exact same spot. Yep. I got the last one. Really? Kid you not. Yep. It could be even be a. Could be playing fish here, I think. Very possibly could be the same fish as last time. Really? Yeah, it could be 39. That is crazy, hey? Yeah. Like, I reckon right on the same pylon. Like. Drag is. My drag is a bit tighter this time, too. Listen to it. Oh, I reckon he's 39. Yeah. Yep. If this is a 39, it's very possible that it's the same fish as last time. On the same snag? On the same pylon, yes. On, on that one, yep. <laughs> oh, he, he's a cracking brim. He's yeah. a good brim. He's a smidge over 38. He's got this nice 38 centimetre brim. Just on a cranker crab underneath the, um, the little wharfs here. And yeah, I was winding it up and he he ate it on the wine so yep newcastle harbour brim for you so we'll put him back and we'll keep fishing yes all right so that's what i've got on to start with um obviously it's a cranker crab and um it's the uv color which is definitely my favorite so far <clears throat> so it's got like an orange belly which I think represents like it's got eggs uh, which I think makes it that just that little bit more realistic uh, if you notice the claws are a different color it's because I had to change them from another crab I had because it actually the brim really demolished the hooks so you can get the hooks they're online if you do damage them I think they might be four dollars a pack so yeah keep that in mind but yeah probably the top three best brim lures probably there is so yeah, but today so far we've actually been well usually we let them sink right and we'll watch our line for any ticks which will happen throughout the day but all the fish so far the three fish have been on the wind up so we're casting as close as we can on the boats or on the wharfs or the pylons so and then once it's hit the bottom just wind it up really slow it just pays to do that because i've caught a couple of brim in my time doing this technique but today we've caught three doing it so yeah just a really slow lot wine on the way up just just in case there is a brim looking at it but um yeah if you can cast as close as you can to structure you're in a really good chance for like the better brim the smaller brim will be off the structure a little bit more and they'll be more inclined to come out but the brim the big brim are right on the on the structure so if you can get right on there that was on the pylon then but yeah, if you can get right on the structure or on the boats, that's what the bigger brim are. And yeah, my setup's just a um, an Aerity, which is new that I just purchased, 2,000 shallow spill Aerity with six pound advanced sig line, which is really nice um, in my opinion for its price, only 40 bucks. And then yeah, I got an amped rod, the Brim Series six foot six ultra light, two to six pounds. So really nice got a, a nice backbone too but a really soft tip so yeah designed for brim but such an awesome combo the best combo i've owned so far and yeah i've just started brim fishing more and just did a, a yak hunters comp down in moi woi um got 11th so not the best but not the worst so but yeah i've really enjoyed it the last couple of couple of weeks it's been i, I don't know like a new favorite thing and this time of year too is really good here and in the marinas and the harbour so especially for bigger brim oh. there'd be ep up there Maybe, uh... yep EP. It's an EP. Yep. He he nearly done me. Oh, 
Yeah, he's not bad. Look at this. <laughs> Scoff the Xeric shrimp. Down he's gone. I changed, I put a jig on it too. So I took the weedless hook off it and just put like a one, could even be like a one sixteenth, I reckon. But look at him. Just got this little bycatch S3 perch. Just cast it in between the um, really gnarly pylons up here. And um, yeah, there'd be a few of these guys around here at the moment. It is closed season, but you can still target them. But um, that was a nice bycatch on a little little Xeric shrimp. So yeah, we'll let him go. 40 and a half he went. Beautiful. Because it's just... Oh, big EP charged out for it. Oh my God. Did you see that? This is where I got, this is where I got the other one on this pod. Like, I'm, I'm telling you. I've seen it, yeah. Yeah. So you saw it, hey? Yeah. He, he was, he was decent too. Oh. He was bolting out for that. Oh my God. You know what? I am gonna put a muscle on. I'm gonna try a muscle, yep. Just something different. Yeah, we'll give it a go for a bit. I've got heaps of them too, so if I lose one, it's not so bad. Yep, let's give the old muscle a go. We'll give it a go. Because they do like muscles. That's a good fish. Oh, oh, God. Oh, he's giving me some curry. Oh, wow. Oh, it's a big brim. It's a big brim. He's caught up. Oh. Oh, on the muscle this time. Wow. Smashed me. Oh yes, he's a cracker. God, he's screamed. Oh, he's he's not as big as I thought, but he's he's 36, I reckon. Look at him. Okay. He's just he's just fat. Yeah, he's like, like he's thick. He's fat. Yeah, like he's really really like thick. Yeah. He's 35. Yeah. But he's just he's just thick. I'd still be happy with that. Oh, yeah. I forget my eyes. Yep. Um, yeah, I think so. He's okay. He's not massive by all means, but he'll do. Oh, he's, he's over 30. He's probably 32. Oh. Yeah, he's not bad, actually. Oh, not bad at all. On the crab. I mean, he's, a, he's a chunky brim. They're very fat and healthy in here, eh? In the harbour. Yeah, he's 32. Yep. Oh, off he goes. 
knocks my Zerik out as well with him. <laughs> oh, there's a brim. Yep. Oh, it's a really good one. It's a really good one, man. Oh no, you gotta reverse, you gotta reverse. You have to get out of there. He's he's a cracker. He's that's the one I reckon I saw. He's 40. Yeah? I reckon he's 40, this one. Oh, he's a horse, man. Oh, look at him. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Is he big? Oh, look at that. What? He's, he's very close to 40. He's huge. Oh my god. <laughs> I seen him in there and I'm like, no, nah, he's, he's eating it. <laughs> he's eating it. <sighs> that's 41, that's gotta be. You reckon that's 40? Yeah, that's 41. <sighs> that's a massive brim, hey. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, that's a good I brim. It's 41. No, what? it's not. Yep, the it's not. The other one was bigger. No, it is. 39. It's about it's about yeah, close to 39 there. Yeah, it'd be 39. That's 40, that middle part. Yeah, I know. It's 39. Why is there heaps of 39s in here? I thought he was going to be 40 for sure. Oh, man. Look at his lips. Look at that. Yeah, they're like blue, aren't they? Yeah. Another nice brim underneath the wharfs here. Once again on the crab. I actually spotted him underneath there and I got right under and yep, he went straight for it. So they seem to be just under 40 these brim, which is frustrating, but they're still quality, so. Big blue lips. Get him in. Come on, buddy. Big brim take a little bit to get going, eh? You on? Ooh. No, it is a brim. Yeah. On the crab? Yep. What did you get him? On the, on the edge? Yeah. I'm letting him because I don't want to lose this crab. Ooh. Yep. What the hell? Ooh, he's not too bad either. He like ate it near the surface, that fish. Yeah, he's alright. Like yeah. 30. Yeah, he's better than bit better than thirty. I reckon he's, I reckon he's thirty-two. Man, he's not bad. Look at him. Oh. oh yeah. Yeah, he's like thirty-three. Thirty-three. Yeah. Jeez, I've caught some good ones today. Yeah. He might be my third biggest. This one. No, sorry. Fourth biggest. I thought it might have been an EP because it like yeah, ate it I near the top. Yeah, he's he's a lot better than we think. This fish. <laughs> I reckon he's thirty-four. Really? Yeah, I do. 35? No, he's thirty-five. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, I thought he looked I was a bit bigger. To guess it, I yeah. Guess all day. Thirty-five. That's. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's that's really good. Good fish. Right, guys, that's going to do us for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Pretty good session in the end. We actually didn't land um, big numbers today, but we certainly landed some decent sized fish. So I find that's probably always better than landing a lot of fish. So yeah, it was good to get the size up. I got a 39, a 38, and a 35 was my three biggest. So pretty happy with that. And um, yeah, Elijah got a couple of good ones too. So yeah. Good to see the harbour's fishing well for brim, so yeah, I don't know, I don't know why I've never like come into the harbour and fished for brim before, but 
I will certainly be doing it way more often. So yeah, Cranker Crabs, the Mussel and the Xeric Shrimp were the three doors that worked for me today. So yeah, but um, anyway, I'm heading back to the boat ramp now. It's um, getting pretty dark, so yeah, hope you enjoy the video guys. And yeah, hopefully I can keep um, the momentum rolling and get some more videos out. So yeah, thanks for watching. Yoop.